Hello again, May Squad, and welcome back to my channel. So today I have an actual unboxing first impressions review, and this is going to be on Bobby Boss Lace Front Swiss Lace MLF 134 Sienna. Okay, and I got her in the color TT1B274. So this is not a new unit, uh, she's been out for a year, but I went ahead and got her. So I kind of wanted another curly unit that kind of reminded me of Ariana because I really, really love the waves on her. And so, but Ariana didn't come in the color I wanted. I wanted more of a blonde. So we're going to see. I'm going to cut the. Alright, let me see. Excuse me, I don't have my full face on. <laughs> I'm gonna do that one once I get to work. But. Okay. So this is Sienna. It's a pretty pretty golden not golden, um pretty kind of yellow blonde. And I love the four. Okay, so she has the two combs in the front, comb in the back, adjustable straps. Bobby Boss is usually big head friendly, but this one doesn't feel like it. So I'm going to undo the adjustable straps. Sorry if you can hear a movie in the background. The kids are watching Minions. So there's not much parting for the lace. Now that I got this, I'm not sure why I got her when I saw, I thought it was more partying space when I saw her in person, but I guess not. So let me go ahead and cut off the lace. So this is her on. I'm being gentle, I'm finger combing her. This is the hairline up close. Okay, so I'm 5'2". She comes to about right here on top of my chest area. So she's probably about 18, 20 inches on me. Okay, I thought I wasn't going to like the blonde, but that's kind of... She's very big. I don't know how it's going to work in this humid Houston weather. I might end up cutting some on her, but I'm gonna wait. Right now the curls are really soft. Oh, she's a soft lace, but she's laying pretty fat, flat, fat, <laughs> flat. So I don't think I'm gonna cut. I mean, I don't think I'm gonna use the got to be glued today, but as far as keeping her down. But because she's a four and my baby hairs are out, I'm going to cut a little bit here to lay some baby hairs down. Uh, right about here. Okay. So that's not about that much, y'all. All right, good night squad. So I am back with my final thoughts. So I know I recorded the first half. I came to work. After driving, I was like, okay, I need to record some additional things to this. So, as I was driving, I was looking in the mirror, and I was like, this unit really looks like a Lexus. I felt like I rebought a Lexus. So, um, I, I believe I have that posted, that Sensational Alexis. And remember I told you I was trying to look for a unit that reminded me of Ariana, because I really, really, really love Ariana. It's just, she didn't come in the color that I wanted. So, basically... If Sensational, Sensational Alexis and Outre or Outre's Ariana got together and made a baby, this would be the baby. So this is Sienna. So I, I like her. It's not that I don't like her. I'm just saying I thought I was getting something different. And I guess it is different, but not really. It's like I already had it. So the only difference would be the color, which I really, really love. I love this for with the blonde. It is just gorgeous um 
<laughs> when I was getting ready to come in for work, I looked in my um, car mirror and I was like, you look like a lion. So <laughs> with the colors and everything, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Uh, you tell me, <laughs> but I do look like a lion. But a pretty lion, right? I look like a pretty, I hope I look like a pretty lion. I, but she is long, so it's scissor time. <laughs> So I really, really like this unit. I just think she's just too long for me um, to wear to work. Now, if I was keeping her <clears throat> as a kind of day off unit, I wouldn't worry about her being so long. But I purchased her to wear to work. So because of that fact, I'm going to have to cut her. So I just wanted to show you guys me taking some length off of her. Okay, so this is my finished look with all the hair cut this is about how much hair I cut off so it's a <laughs> pretty decent amount because uh, remember it came down to the top of my right at my boob so you know I probably cut off a good four or five inches off the hair I probably could add a little bit more layers in the 27 color just so you can see more of the four but so far I'm liking what I've done here this is a gorgeous color like I don't know if you can see this but it is so beautiful that four with the 27 it breaks the having the four in there kind of breaks up the 27 so it's not just so so yellowy so here's uh, the unit with me turning to the right side and then here's to the left and then here's to the back. So I guess I should I should have done that before I cut her. But um, there are um, some other reviews on her on YouTube. So if you want to see her um, in, towards the back, you can definitely t check that out. So I did open up this part area. So I just wound the strands around my fingers and kind of pulled out some of the area so that way it opens up the part because remember you don't get that much parting space you get this is probably about an inch and a half parting space on here and then this is lace I'm not lace then this is these are the tracks right here so you only get about this much if you part down the middle you get a little bit more maybe about two inches but if you're doing kind of like the deep side part you're only going to get about an inch and a half so keep that in mind like I said it doesn't bother me to not have that much parting space on a big curly unit because it's supposed to have volume it's supposed to be big for me I did have to use go ahead and at first I said I wasn't gonna going to do it but I did go ahead and use my uh, got to be glued to actually glue down the um, wig because she was starting to slide back at work and mm -mm, mm -mm. I, can't, I can't be checking on my customers and then you see my hair moving back like that's that's not cute that's not cute at all so when I, when I got to the mirror, I was like, okay, yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't do this. So, and I didn't have any bobby pins and the combs didn't help. So I did put the combs in, but they don't attach to my hair. I don't know why, but they don't secure the unit for me. So only bobby pins and the got to be glued work for me. Anyway, let me get ahead and get off of here. If you have any questions or comments, definitely leave them down below. I'll get back to you. Also, please don't forget to subscribe and give this a video a thumbs up if you liked it. And hit the bell for notifications so you know when a new video is headed your way. And don't forget to tell yourself you're awesome and that you love yourself. Because you got to respect, respect yourself first and love yourself first before you can love someone else or have them return that love back to you. So until next time, guys. Bye.